Good morning from a uh, very windy uh, North Devon beach. Um, I haven't been on the beach for ages, so I thought I'd spend a few hours here. Um, there's a spring tide. There's a dog just uh, banged into me. Spring tide is here. Um, water's quite high, and if you turn around, you can look at all the rubbish at the back. All built up. Anyway. I'll see you on the first. Oh, that's my first target, a four-hole button. Reading a 31 on the legend. I'm on uh, medium wet and uh, ground balance at zero. Let's uh, see what happens. Well, first corner of a day out of black sand. Uh, it's got to be a little half pee, I think. Yeah, half P. Right, let's move on. This was reading in mid 40s, and it's a spoon. <laughs> mid 40s. It's quite heavy, that, probably because of all the sand in it. I'll give that a little clean when I get back, just in case. So there's any oil marks on it or whatever. Yeah, let's carry on. The wind's picking up and it's started to rain. Never mind. Love it when I find these. Um, the follow shop's so good. Come here. Oops. Nearly went in me all myself. Yeah, that just needs straightening up at the top. That's not in bad condition. Nice. Quite a big showcase, isn't it? Quite happy with that. That'll clean up well. And all I've got to do is put a bit of wood in there and just straighten it. And then uh, polish it up. Lovely. Right, let's move on. This was reading 38. I can't do anything about this wind, it's gale force here. And I can just see it sticking out there, which I think is going to be three decimal penny. Yeah, that's what it is. definitely a pre decimal one penny you can just make out the uh, Britannia there sitting just there can't get any cleaner until I get home yeah happy with that one pre decimal penny happy days Excuse this wind, but it's it is gale force. And I'm doing my best to uh, shield it. I think I've got another coin down here. Uh, reading a 45. Now what's that one? That looks like a. I don't know. Two shilling. Two shilling piece. Either silver coming through. Happy days, happy with that, definitely happy with that. One florin. Ah, made up. You see the word florin down there? Now that will clean up nice. I'm quite happy with that. I don't know what the date is, but I'll give that a clean when I get back. Let's just have a quick look. George. Happy days, let's move on. Absolutely made up with this coin, it's a one florin. Um, all that crud will come off it. Um, there's Georgie. 
So I don't know whether that's 50% silver or 99% or, uh, silver. But I need to get, get to the date. Happy days. This was really mid 40s. Um, I've just had the flooring out of that hole there. And now I've got a threepenny bit. Look at that. That is in good condition. Happy days. 19, 1943. That's not bad. Three three decimals this morning. That will clean up lovely. Right, let's move on. Another shell case, mid forties. And um, these are always deep. But the legend picks them out. Look at that. Never want to be cleaned up. And they're lovely when they're uh, polished, really are. Happy days. Right, let's move on. This was an high pitched signal and it's just a 2p. Very high pitched. Right, let's move on. This was reading 54 and it's another 2p. Quite an high tone. There it is. Right, let's move on. Another coin, another 2p. Yep, oh, sorry, there you go, 2p. Queen Elizabeth, God rest her soul. This is reading 45, and now I've lost it. There it is. I think that's another threepenny bit. It is. Let me just give that a clean. Happy days. Second one I've had today. Sorry about the wind. God, didn't think about it. What date's on there? 1964. Oh, the detector's going to fall over. Just give me a sec. Yeah, 1964. <clears throat> right, let's carry on. Just found this reading a 29. Some sort of... I uh, don't know whether it's a buckle or just a clip. Sorry, there you go. Just a clip of some sort. Off the boats, I would say. Wind's still high. Um, the sun's out though, that's the main thing. And it stopped raining. Right, let's carry on. Just found this key, reading a 43. Been down there for quite a bit. Right, let's move on. Right then, back from the uh, beach. Um, spent, what, three, three and a half hours. Um, let's look, look at the junk, bolts, key, bit of copper, copper, didn't know what that is, bit of steel, um, that item would have been off one of the boats I would say, buckle type thing, uh, two four old buttons, 
um, this spoon and it's got a date on it 1960 something 1961 I think it is uh, shell cases a small one there and then two 20, mil 20 millimeter they come up really nice when you uh, give them a clean um, date on there is 1943 so Second World War era uh, coins I just before going to the coins I didn't film this but I, what I know, did notice I just shoved it in my bag um, no idea what it's off but it's got uh, happy birthday there oh excuse me right coins uh, three two pences um, half p two threepenny bits one dated 1964 and the other one focus 1943 um, one penny 1935 I think that is and star find of a day was obviously this florin which I've given a, a rub um, with a silver cleaning cloth and I'm going to leave it like that that's dated 1928 one florin piece I think that's the first for me I found the the two shilling pieces but not a florin type pattern uh, so this is the first for me and uh, that's a beauty anyway that's me finds for today and I'll see you on my next hunt take care everybody